we have control terminology document right so in the control terminology document they will we won't have control terminology for all the variables specified in the dm domain like here if you see we don't have control terms for your study id like whatever the value you want you can write in the study id but coming to the domain you should not write domain name as like complete name like demographics or you cannot write dm in the small letters like whatever they mention like here dm is caps right you should mention only the dm in the capital letters that is about the control terminology in the control terminology let me show you the control terminology also it is opening So control terminology is uh, like whatever the values they specify, only those values need to be mentioned, right? That we have discussed yesterday. So let me show you the SDTM terminology. Yes, it has opened. Let me show you. So this is the control terminology document. So if you type DM or domain, so if you click on the domain, are you able to see the domain SDTM domain abbreviation, or else you are seeing something? Let me know. Yeah, we can see. Okay, so here you can see AD, A, A, G, and if you type C M, which is concatenated medication. Let us check for D M. See here we have D M. Like all the D Ms are in the. So what is this value? You should submit the value whatever the domain you are creating. It should be like C disk submission value whatever the under the C disk submission value you should submit like this only in the, all the. Values should be caps, and there it must be only two letters for your domain name, and synonym definition and NCA preferred term. These all you don't need, but how should you submit your value is specified here. Like I said, domain. I said DM, right? Okay, let me click again. Domain. So here you need to click. Like here, you can see C disk definition, a unique two character domain code used in the regulatory submission. So this is what they say. Like if you click on the domain, so those domain you are searching for will be applied. So for the demographics, how should you submit your domain name? Like DM, and instead of domain, let me show you for your sex variable also. So I'm entering sex, and. Let me write a six. No, let me search. See here, I have six. Are you able to see this six? So if you click on the six, this opening. See, are you able to see the six variable? Yes, ma'am. Okay. So here we should submit like either F 
like here whatever the under seed is submission value like either you should submit f or you need to submit m you should submit like u or undifferentiated other than these four you should not submit anything Like if you submit like a female complete name, you should not do like this. Like you, either F, M, U. So that is what control terminology says. If you see the spec again, you have control terminology for your sex variable. Like let me show you the sex variable. See here you have the control terminology. See here, sex. You have control terminology like sex. and you have control terminology for age age u and you don't have control terminology for your age like whatever you want you can mention in the age variable and you have control terminology for your race variable again and you don't have again for this see again you have control terminology for rfsdtc like iso 8601 so if you know the sas you know what is iso 8601 can anyone tell what is iso 8601 format we have discussed in the sas classes so can anyone i think it is a date and time combination yeah so yes whatever you said is right it is a mm -hmm. 